Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix this offline error. And once you click on OK, uh, you receive this pop-up which, which tells you we could not activate the game. So if you're receiving these errors, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now the first step is to check for any outage or if there is any kind of known issue, check it on EA website. So go to the EA forum or EA website and check if there is any kind of outage. If there is no outage, uh, then sign in with EA account and when you receive offline error, click on OK and then relaunch the game. You might have to try multiple times. So when you receive this error, enter your e email, EA email and password over here. Log in with your EA account. Click on sign in. So you might receive this error first. So click on OK. If you receive this prompt, enter your email and password, your EA account which has the game and then click on sign in. You might have to sign in multiple times and then it may work one time so this happened with me so you can try this and check if that does not work delete all files in the license folder now for this you can go to a file explorer go to this pc open c drive now open program data if you don't see program data at the top click on view select show put a check on hidden items and then open program data folder now find electronic arts folder open this folder open ea services folder here you can see license folder Copy this folder, create a backup first. So once you have a backup created over here, now you can go back to File Explorer, open this license, and then you can delete the content of license folder, delete it, and then relaunch the game and then check. If that does not work, restart your computer once, and after the system restart, launch the game and then check. Still not working. The next step is to delete the temporary files. Now for this, type in run in Windows search box, and then click on run over here. Type in temp temp and then select everything. Control A, shift, delete, continue. Skip. Now again, open run box. And then in the run box, type in percentage, temp percentage. And then select everything, shift, delete. Continue. And once this is done, try to relaunch the game and then check. Still not working. The next step is to repair or verify the game file. If you have the game on EA app, click on manage, click on repair. Once the repair is done, launch the game. If you have the game on Steam, uh, I don't have the game on Steam. So if you have the game on Steam, uh, you can just make a right click on the game. Uh, I'll show you a different game. This is just an example. Okay any game yeah so i'll show you a different game make a right click and then go to properties go to install files tab and then click on verify integrity of game files after the verification you can launch the game and then check still not working the next step is to perform ea app recovery now for this type in ea app in windows search box and then make a right click on ea app and then click on open file location before this close ea app so you can just exit ea app and then once you are in the location, you can just make a right click on app recovery and then click on run as administrator. And then click on yes to allow. You will see clear cache option. So you have to click on clear cache. This will relaunch EA app and then you can check. Still not working. The next step is to repair EA app. To repair EA app, you can go to EA website. So you can search EA app in Google search, go to EA website and then click on download the app windows and then run this exe file now do not launch the app click on repair and once let the repair complete the repair will take some time and once the repair is done it will launch e app and then you can check still not working the next step is to run this command these commands are provided in the video description Type in CMD in Windows search box, make a right click on command prompt app and then click on run as administrator. Make sure that you open command prompt as an administrator and copy all these commands one by one. Paste it over here, hit the enter key. Now once done, restart your computer. And after the system restart, you can check. If that does not work, perform power cycle. For this, you can shut down your computer first. Now, after you shut down your computer, 
unplug the power cable from the computer, then turn off the Wi-Fi router, and then restart the Wi-Fi router after a few seconds, and then plug in the power cable back to the computer, and then restart the computer, and then check. The last step is to uninstall and reinstall the game. So if something is working, you can uninstall the game and then reinstall the game and then you can check. You can reinstall the game to different drive and then check. But make sure that you log in with right account which has the game. If you have the game on Steam, make sure that you log in uh, when you launch the game. Make sure your Steam account and EA account is linked. You can go to EA website and you can go to account and then go to connected platform and then over here you will see Steam. You can link it and then you can launch the game. So one of the steps shown in this video should help you to fix this these error. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.